The machine is a project that began way back in 2012 when I got access to an oil and gas operation in Alaska. Why would I want access to an oil and gas operation in Alaska? Fair question, fair question. Look in that room, he said there may be some more in there, man. All right, hold another can of dope. While I consider myself strongly pro-renewable energy, I have to acknowledge the dependency uh, that we have on fossil fuels. And I was interested in really examining that uh, and having the unique opportunity to go to an oil rig, a place I would personally never find myself or necessarily want to be. Um, I was sort of fascinated by that. What we're doing on a daily basis, extracting oil or punching that hole to get oil, I'll be able to see for generations to come because, you know, we use oil for everything. The prescription meds that are saving someone's life is coming from petroleum, and I'm part of that process. My small camera crew and I spent a total of 16 days on this oil and gas exploration rig near Anchorage, Alaska, and really tried to be flies on the wall observing the ongoings of this strange and mysterious world that we'd never experienced. What we're up to right now is we're uh, going in a hole in three and a half inch tubing on a scraper run. They're saving a little time here. Instead of using drill pipe, they're using the tubing on the drill pipe. There is this strange sort of reverence they all had for the job almost like they're in a meditation. <laughs> They're there for so long. They spend 28 days on the rig and 28 days off. Some stay there longer. The environment is ruthless. If you fall over the rail, you can die within minutes. The currents that go through the Cook Inlet can get up to 15 knots. The water's so cold that your body will just give out and your muscles will seize up and you'll drown. I mean, these guys are human beings doing a job that we all depend on, whether we like it or not, in our current state, you know, our current state of civilization depends on them doing their job. Morning, gentlemen. Morning. How we got the rest? Sure. <laughs> okay, uh, preload's on, holding. We'll be dumping that baby. What about the boat? The footage is all there. It's shot. It needs a good two to four months of editing. Stock footage, music, and I'd like to start submitting it for 2017 festivals. And that's, of course, an expensive process. So if you can help, I promise not to disappoint with the final product and to finish it and get it out there and uh, for everyone to see. <laughs>